Welcome back. We've got the Discovery Center here with us today. We've got Jennifer Noble. How are you doing this morning? I'm good. It's been a minute, so I'm glad yeah. to be back. We're, we're glad to have you back in here. And as always, you know, we've got just like this myriad of things here <gasps> that are all going to come together to make a science experiment. We've got eggs. We've got a Pringles can. We've got a balloon. But before we get into any of that, we got to talk about things happening at the Discovery Center, right? Yes, always. I love talking about the Discovery Center, but it's good because that's my job. So yes. um, I've been, we did a Girls Who Science on Monday, and so that went really well. One of our volunteers, she is a very well-practiced entomologist and has a really crazy bug collection. Very nice. So we got to play around with some bugs, and uh, bugs are weird. Bugs are weird. They are weird. They can be cool. They, yeah. are, they do a lot for us, and so it was really fun to learn about a, their purpose and why they have so many legs. Yeah. So it's fun. I mean, that's, that's good for sure. And so you got another one coming up you yeah. know, in May, got another Girls Who Science coming up. But before that, you got some events for tomorrow because a lot of kids may be having a day off of school, come to the Discovery Center, yes. do some cool things, right? Yes. And so, and... I told uh, I told you earlier that it was going to be tomorrow, and I lied. It was oh. uh, it's going to be on Saturday. Saturday, hey, that works so, too. So uh, it'll be on Saturday, and we're going to have some explosions, some exciting nice. science experiments. I like and, it. And uh, it's going to be pretty thrilling and themed. Yes, hey, so, exciting. Yes, exactly. Exactly. Ha. Ha. Double <laughs> on that one. So we got that, and also, you know, we're barely in the springtime. Yes. It's April, but let's look ahead to summer. Yes. Summer camps at the Discovery Center. So we have our last day camp tomorrow and it's completely sold out and that's the way we're trending for our summer camps and so if you guys want to get your kids into the classes at the Discovery Center, do it quickly because they're selling out pretty fast. So check us out on our website, go ahead and register and um, get them in. We've got some really great themes, we've got some awesome activities coming and uh, it's, it's so crazy fun. Nice. I always really need a nap at the end of the summer, but by it... That means it was a good day. Yeah, it's so, yeah. so cool, the stuff we get to do, and it's going to be bigger and better than ever this year, so... Hey, well, we're looking forward to that, but like you said, this weekend, there's going to be some explosions at the Discovery Center. I was promised explosions right here in the studio, so what have we got? What is all this going to add up and make for us? Okay, so this balloon... Now, I've brought this in the studio before, and it's, yes. it's lighter than air. I push it down, it pops back up. Yep. Um, it's a gas. Normally, when we think of gases that are lighter than air, what do we think of? Helium. Helium. It's, Emeril is known for it. This is not helium. So this is quite a bit more dangerous than helium. This is hydrogen. All right. It's the other gas that's lighter than air, and uh, we brought it in the studio to do some fun things. So right. we're going to put our safety, safety first. goggles on. That's right. Very stylish, and of course. <laughs> Center. That's right. Um, so we're gonna fill this guy up with hydrogen. Okay. So, so is that an empty eggshell right there? It's an We've empty eggshell. Empty eggshell. Okay. I my kids were excited because I made them breakfast. So nice. <laughs> so I'm gonna fill it up with this gas. Okay. You need an extra set of hands on this. Or you got um, it. So I'm gonna take my finger off and then I'll let you do the next one. Okay. And we're gonna light it. So here we go. Here we go. Okay. So I heard it light. It went. And bit. so we're just going to wait. And as it starts to pull oxygen into this egg. <laughs> I get more and more I concerned. Know, I get really nervous. That's okay. So I know it lit. And so this one may have a crack in it somewhere. So it may not do what we want it to because it would have exploded by now. Okay. So we're just going to give it a second. Okay, yeah. And then <laughs> we're going to let the anticipation build, build for a second before. It's exciting. Maybe. Yeah, we're fine. Okay, we got okay. it done there. Okay. So. We're gonna try this guy well, as I drop it. It's okay. um, and then we're gonna do this. And I brought a backup sure. if these guys don't work. So. Here we go. Ooh. Okay. Okay, here we go. Laying that on there. Oh. We're gonna redo that one. Okay. Good thing we got extra hydrogen. Right? And I don't know if you can tell that I've had too much caffeine this morning. My hands are shaking. Also, got a nice zoomed in shot of it. Yeah. So I hear it cracking. Okay. We're gonna see. Now we wait. So the fuel acts like a wick, <coughs> and okay. as it comes out of the egg, then it will pull oxygen in on the side. And so because it's not working on this one, we're gonna fill this Pringles can up. And okay. We're gonna show exactly what this. It's is hard to crack do. a Pringles can. It's hard to crack a Pringles can, but it should get popping. All right. So. Uh, go. See, that's okay. that's the fun thing about this is all the anticipation. Yes, it does have a lot of anticipation. Yeah. Okay, so you're trapping the hydrogen so, in trapping there. Trapping the hydrogen in okay. there. It's pushed all of the air out of the Pringles can. So 
There we go. Oh, there we go. So now, now it's you have, lit. You can see it burning. There's a little bit of a fire there, and okay. you can see the heat coming off of it. Now you may want to plug your ears okay. just in case. You got because it. Because as it starts pulling the oxygen in on a hole at the bottom, it's going to start uh, mixing the oxygen with the fuel. Okay. And so as the oxygen and the fuel become like they get to a correct combo, it's going to uh, start stop burning. <laughs> There we go. Like a candle, <laughs> yeah. and it'll start uh, create a combustion reaction inside the can, and it builds some pressure, nice. and it gets popping. So, there you go. Yeah. I like it. That is spectacular. And so that's just a little taste <sighs> of what you can see at the Discovery Center, because yeah. as you always say, at the Discovery Center, that's where you get to do all the things we can't do in here. Exactly. So yes. this will give me enough time to figure out why the eggs don't work, and you actually get to see it live. Hey, so. well, excited to hear about that. So that's yeah. going to be happening on Saturday. Yeah. Of course, get those summer camp registrations in. Yes. All that good stuff, but thank you for coming and talking to us today. Absolutely. Thanks for letting me science with you guys. Of course. We're always glad to have you on.